Hello and welcome to another video. Today I just want to make a quick video and it's something that I've bought recently on Amazon. It's a HDMI capture card, which I believe is the cheapest that you can get. And I think I've been stung. I paid £20 for it and I thought that was the bargain of a lifetime. But now I'm actually seeing it for as little as £5.99. And is this little man here. And it's supposed to be 1080p, it takes 4K, it doesn't actually, you can't actually broadcast in 4K, or record in 4K. USB-A, it's not USB-C, but you also get, if you're looking for USB-C, you do actually get an adapter with it. But I'll just gonna read, it's very generic. Uh, I think mine was called Elec Live, but uh, basically the brand is, could be any other brand, but they all look exactly like this. They all look exactly the same. Uh, so it supports resolution up to 4K. Um, input resolution, support output resolution is maximum at 1080p. And uh, supports 8, 10, 12 bit deep color. Uh, supports most acquisition software such as VLC, VLC OBS at 1080p. Uh, supports Windows, Android and Mac OS. But at the moment I'm actually using a capture card to record this. I'm using it through Ecamm Live. So I'm gonna see if this is any good. And dare I say it could even be better because the one I'm using is a generic capture card. I've had it for maybe about a year. Cost me about 50 pounds, took me about two weeks to arrive. Came from China. I got this within two or three days of Amazon. So let's see if the quality you're seeing now can be improved with this little capture card. I'm just gonna unplug it in. Never used it yet, so it should be fun. Let's see. And there we go. This is it. This, I've just literally just plugged it in. And I don't know if you can see any difference. I'm looking at my monitor now and I don't think I can see much difference at all. And this would have, could have cost me 5 99 But even at 20 quid, it's an absolute bargain. As I said, the one I've paid, which was non-generic, is 50 quid. Uh, you buy an Elgato, it's going to be well over £100. So if this thing breaks, just buy another one, you know? <laughs> It's not going to break the bank. I mean, I had an Elgato before. It stopped working after about a year and a half. You know, it's well over £100. So, it were really inter I actually think that is a better picture than the one I've got. As I said, mine is non-generic. Or it is just a generic one. It's non-brand um, non name. But this looks really pretty, pretty decent. It's interesting to see what it's like for gaming, but then again, I don't really use, I wouldn't be using one of these for gaming if I was a serious gamer. Um, so I don't really think that's really worth an argument. I'm just looking at my, my monitor there because that's the, the what I'm looking at. Uh, that's the feed I'm looking at uh, without actually looking at it again in post. So I'm just gonna leave it at that. I'm just gonna leave it completely at that. What do you think? That is a bargain, I think, an absolute bargain. You can get it on eBay. I'm gonna put the links in the description if you like. Um, you can get it on Amazon. I think it's 25 pounds for the same one that I got, but I did pay 20 pounds for it. Or you can just get it on eBay for 5.99 or 10 pounds, run about that price. Fantastic, there we go. Hope you like this video. If you like it, give a like, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Subscribe for more.